us, Minnesotans, the clouds cleared out just enough at times overnight to get a look at the supermoon. Even at this hour, here's a live look. You can see the supermoon uh, peeking through uh, those kind of fast moving clouds up there. Still this big. Morning. Yep, still, still looks bright. Good. All of the, the pictures have been really fun to see. Uh, obviously, uh, a lot of wonderful photographers out there. This is Vegas, Washington, D.C. Monty Bubbles with that photo. Yeah, oh, <laughs> Monty Bubbles. Uh, uh, Australia here, yeah. a little cloudy. I, I got to be honest, these pictures aren't that good. We've had no, better, these are we pretty had, terrible. We had better <laughs> pictures from uh, on Facebook. So this is uh, the view that one of our photographers captured in that's, Minneapolis. There you go. It's beautiful. That's, I will that's say that I tried taking my iPhone and taking a picture. It just no. it doesn't do it justice. No, no good. You need at all. like a real camera. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And there's some tricks. Like I will say, I've also enjoyed like the little tips uh, for the next time around when you go to photograph yeah. the moon. To make sure something else is in the shot. Oh, so for a comparison. building yeah. or yeah, otherwise it's just all shots of the moon. Look, yeah. they fill the frame, you know. I think my biggest tip uh, was just to get Monty bubbles to take the one <laughs> oh, for you. Oh man. Can't Monty. go wrong with that. If I ever get into like an Anthony Weiner type scandal, I'm gonna use the pseudonym Monty, Monty Bubbles. bubbles. Yep. Let's yeah. hope that don't. you don't. Right? I'm just saying planning Let's ahead. Hope you, don't. you know what, Kim, don't tell me how to live my life. <laughs> yeah.